Hello. What I'm going to do today is just a short tutorial that I got a request for a couple of days ago. Um, my tutorials have been a little thin on the ground recently because I'm right in the middle of my final undergraduate exams, so that's kind of what I've been focusing on more than making videos. But this tutorial was just how to edit the summary and author section of an ESP. So, you know, when you go to save your ESP, which I'll just do now, I'll just call it um, summary tutorial. And you know when you open up an ESP, like summary tutorial, this thing here, summary, created by default. And if you ever try to edit this by actually typing something, it will crash. Now you can edit it by going to FNV Edit, which you can download from the Fort New Vegas Nexus. There's also a Fallout 3 Edit, FO3 Edit, which works the same way. But I don't actually have that on my computer, so I'm just going to launch FNV Edit. And now you'll get a whole list of your mods will show up. So I'm just going to only check summary tutorial and uncheck everything that I don't want to use, which is going to include all of the masters that aren't associated with the file. So all I've got is Fort New Vegas ESM and summary tutorial loaded. I will just close my GEC now. And before you edit anything in uh, FNV Edit or FO3 Edit, you should always make sure you back up the ESP. Because if I have done this as a test and haven't had any problems, you just don't know. It is quite um, can be quite fiddly. So we click on this little plus, and file header is the only option because that's all there is in this mod. If there was more stuff, other things would appear down here. And you'll see here we have CNAM author default. You remember we saw default appear in the other thing. So we can right click edit, and this is going to come up. And so this is why we need to back up because you just don't know. There could just be an unforeseen glitch. Yes, I'm absolutely sure. And I'm going to put in Seddon4494 as the author. And now, SNAM description. That was that is what is going to appear under the summary section. So I'm going to right click add, right click edit. And now we should be able to put something in here like I'm doing this for a tutorial. Okay. And so now we can just hit close, and this will come up, save changed files, like this. And we're just going to hit OK. So now I'm going to load up the GEC, and open, Fort New Vegas ESM. I don't know why I always have to uncheck these, because it just, they don't check automatically in Fallout 3. If anyone knows how to fix that, uh, a comment would be welcome. And now Summary Tutorial contains, created by 74494, Summary, I'm doing this for a tutorial, and you can set active file and open it just like you would of any other mod. So that was that really just a short tutorial, a short request I got. So um yeah I just thought I'd do it quickly so it's a nice easy tutorial. Remember if you're gonna edit anything in FO free edit or FMV edit, always back up your ESP because you some you know, it can be quite you know, I'd always be a little bit nervous about editing using that, but it's this this has worked for me in tests and hasn't caused any problems, but it might cause unforeseen problems, which is why a backup is always necessary. So thank you for watching this tutorial, I hope you enjoyed it and hope it was useful, goodbye.